Hey guys, um, welcome to an Angry Bat. Sorry, I kind of not been making videos in a while. Um, you know, I think this is episode five. You know, I've been sick and stuff. But um, anyway, today we're coming back strong and with another NES game. We'll probably have. Uh, I'm going to try to get through the NES games first that I own. Then we'll go to SNES, then we'll go to N64. Because I bet I have a lot on the N64 that is going to suck majorly. So today, we're going to play Rampage. Um, just to give you all a little synopsis really quick. Um, Rampage, it's almost like an arcade game. You see how much you can go? Actually, no. Number one arcade hit. It is an arcade game. It is based off of the uh, Godzilla franchise. Um, and it's also got King Kong in it. You know, my dad told me for the longest time that, that it wasn't King Kong, it was Donkey Kong. You know, because cause of uh, the NES games and stuff like SNES. He didn't know much on the subject. And then you can, of course, play as Godzilla, but as Player 2. That's not their actual names, though, in the game. In the actual game, their names are something and something. They're not act. They're not named like that. But for this, I will call them Godzilla and King Kong. So, let's get this started. Rampage is, you know, it's an arcade game, but here is the two characters that I was talking about. George and Lizzie. So, you know, we'll go in as George. Alright, and so, your main goal is to go up these little tiny, tiny towers, and then just punch it. That's it. You know, until they go down to and they go into the ground. You know, it's simple, but they screwed it up somehow. Um, I'm not good with playing this with one hand, and I don't have anything to record it with, really. I can't see like which button I'm pushing because well A punches for some reason and B jumps. You know, and uh pretty much easily if you want an like a easy win, you know, just press A and sometimes you'll get something like that to happen. You know, it's honestly pretty simple. You know, but see, my dad, when he originally played this, like back in the 80s, he, he went through it for like 10 hours. You know, because it just, you know, there's not much of a score or anything. There's a health bar, and you can just pretty much come back anytime by just pressing the B button. So, there's not much of a game here. It is two player, though. You know, you had King Kong, Godzilla, yeah, who, who wouldn't want to play that? But I don't think you'd want anybody to play this game with you, because it's just so bad. I mean, it's better than some of the games I've gotten on here, but, you know, it's not that good. So, let's go and give it a rate. So, Rampage. It's a good idea, you know, um... Not the best game to put on an arcade. It's not that hard. You know. Even the arcade version. If the arcade version is this bad. Those consoles. Or those. You know. Those arcades. Need to be taken out. To pasture. This game. There is pretty much no point to it. 
I mean, people might say the same thing, like, oh, there's no point in video games. But, I mean, at least you're going for a bigger goal. Not just to get a higher score. You know, or at least make it harder. You know, like, how Donkey Kong is. You gotta, you gotta dodge the, uh, you know, it's, it's like patterns. There is no pattern to this game. It's just a play to win. You know, there is no strategy. There is no timing. It's just punch, 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 jump, 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 climb, 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 punch, punch, punch. That's all. Seriously, this game is poison. It's the time waster of the day. I mean, at least in Mario Brothers, it'd be some challenge, and you'd know that you had gotten through a game. And you can go through the game multiple times, yes, but you get better and better every time. This one, you can literally just spam the A button and just move around some. You win! You don't even have to press the B button. You don't even have to jump. They just added that in. For whatever reason. The game itself, it's not buggy or anything. It actually looks pretty good. But just the way it's played, it's bad. Just bad. So, uh, to Data East, I hope you're making better stuff these days. Alright. Bye, guys. Oh, and also the rating, 5 out of 10. Bye!